everyone, my name is Taylor Corey and this is Chit Chat Thursday with Taylor. In this episode, I'll be talking to the mayor of Hattiesburg, Toby Barker, and I'm truly excited that he's here, and let's do this. So, what is your current plans to help people with disabilities within our community? Well, you know, the city of Hattiesburg does have a, a disability advocate who, who is looking to uh, look at across the board what we do as a city and try tries to make sure that we're meeting our uh, our requirements and guidelines under uh, Americans with Disabilities Act. And so, uh, one thing that's that I have noticed that we really need to focus on is our sidewalks in in our neighborhoods. Um, that you know, oftentimes they they go to the edge and they just drop off, and there's no mm. there's no sort of ramp down. And so, you know, trying to get those cuts into the sidewalk where you know if you're in a wheelchair, you need to be able to traverse our city streets just as if you were a vehicle. And so one mm -hmm. thing that we have to do uh, is invest more in sidewalks. We have to go into our older neighborhoods and try to make sure that our sidewalks are handicap accessible. And as uh, uh, my wife and I have a, have a one-year-old, and so as, we're, as my wife walks her throughout our neighborhood over, on, over in the in Park Haven neighborhood, uh, it's an older neighborhood, and, and the, you know, a lot of the sidewalks aren't ADA yet and so mm -hmm. you know so she tries she has to kind of lower the stroller down onto the street <laughs> and then walk across and uh, that's just something we have to do a better job of as a city and it's something I'm committed to do as mayor. That's awesome to hear you're gonna make our city accessible for anybody. Absolutely. That's a wonderful goal. How are you working with the Institute for Disability Studies and what do you see for the future collaborations? Well, I've been a long and uh, long time admirer of this of this institute uh, mm -hmm. when I was in, in grad school and then when I was in the legislature uh, and then now working as mayor. Uh, I, I think that we've developed kind of a, a relationship where if, if the if IDS needs something they can reach out to me and, and I can do likewise. Uh, I look forward to trying to sit down and, and seeing what are the real needs in our community, not only from a a you know physical infrastructure like like sidewalks we were talking about, but also what are the human needs? What what, what do we need to be working on? You know job opportunities, mm -hmm. making sure folks have a place to plug in and live live productive lives in the least restrictive environment. Yes, because you want to be have to you want to have housing, have access to education, and be able to be walk around the sidewalk. Well, yeah, and it's, it is the Hattiesburg way to look out for each other and, mm -hmm. and to celebrate each other's successes and to pick each other up when there's a need. And so uh, it's one thing I love about this community, and it's one thing that I hope that we can continue to make better as, as we go through our administration. The way you're going, it sounds pretty awesome. I'm going to look forward to what you're going to accomplish for the city of Hattiesburg. Well, I appreciate it, and I look forward <laughs> to seeing your future episodes of this show, too. So. Oh, yes. And what is any advice for our viewers you want to share and resources? Well, I think that if, if, there, if there's a need, uh, we always invite folks to call our action line, which is 601-545-4500. It's 545-4500. Uh, mm. um, you can also like us on Facebook at the City of Hattiesburg Government. Uh, we, we check that, we update that page three or four times a day with different news that's going on in the city or if there's a road that's closed, we try to put that out there. We also respond to messages when people reach out to us if there's an issue. And so anytime there's a need like that, call us at the action line, 545-4500, or check us out on Facebook, or go to our website, HattiesburgMS.com. I mean, there's lots of ways you can touch base with us. That is fantastic. Thank you so much for having your time to be here on this episode. Hey, Chit Chat. glad to be here. Wonderful. And for more information, please check us out at www.usm.edu slash disability dash studies. And don't forget to like and subscribe our video. And check out the main IDS Facebook page for more updates about Chit Chat Thursdays with Taylor. This is Taylor Carly signing out.